when I tell you the amount of comments I got on my last video telling me and black women telling other black women to date outside of their race, listen, I got like one more black man left that I'm that I'm a date and then I'm a I'm a dip I'm a dip my toe in the mayonnaise, okay? What? I just think, me personally speaking, it's hard for me to date outside my race because since I was, you know, young and when I first started dating, I just had this idea that, like, I would marry a black man, I would have beautiful black children, you know, and I just wanted to have that black family dynamic. But now that I'm older and my dating experiences, I'm going to have to reevaluate what my family is going to look like. The question I have is, where's your accountability? And the fact is, this, ladies, this black women, you are the most undesirable race of women on this planet. Definitely in the West as a whole. You think, oh, I'm going to go find somebody else that's a different race than me. They don't want to deal with you either. Just be honest. They don't want to deal with all this attitude and all this stuff you got. The reason why you want to go to this other race is because you think they will put up with your crap. But they're not. Men are smarter than you think. Men know what you're doing. And you're making videos talking about it. You ain't the only one. You keep playing these games. Oh, black men don't want me. Black men ain't good enough. You know what? Black men are not good enough for you. That's why you keep playing these games. Y'all don't want to change nothing. You don't think you have no room for improvement. Y'all all think y'all tens. Y'all all think y'all ish don't stink. Y'all all think y'all better than men. Y'all don't listen. You're not respectful or anything like that. A lot of y'all walk around with all these fake accessories on and all this attitude, all of this stuff that y'all do, and you think there's nothing wrong with you because women don't hold you accountable. You can't handle the truth. All your little buddies keep you single by cheering you on with this bad behavior, and you think in the end it's going to actually lead to something positive. It's not. You go out there and you mess with them men in other races. You know what's going to happen? They're going to play with you, too. They're going to just get the box and bounce, too, just like any other man would because they don't want to deal with your crap. How you think a man of another race is going to look at you and say, damn, even the men in her own race don't want her? Or what is her problem not wanting to date men in her own race? Black women are the only women, the only women that have such a problem with their own uh, opposite. The only ones. Black men are always the problem. Black men are always the issues, but black women never are. It's the biggest piece of dog shit. They never are. They have nothing to work on. I'm strong and I'm independent and you got to accept me like I am or you got to be able to handle me. Ain't no man going to want to handle you and deal with all of that. You need to work on yourself. That's your problem. You've been told that you don't have one, but you do. And you've been having it for decades, for generations. And until you change that, black men ain't going to want to deal with you. That's the reason. You see, this whole thing about, oh, black men don't like black women. That's garbage. Black men love black women, but black women sure as hell don't seem to love black men. They don't seem to respect black men. They're the first ones to throw black men under the bus. You can talk all you want about racism and history and all this stuff, but black women in the last few generations, last couple generations for sure, have been black men's worst enemy. The worst. But y'all want to talk about us like we're not, we don't want you or we're not good enough. It's because of you. Our first, first choice is you. Understand that. But if you keep making it difficult for us to choose you, we're going to stop choosing you. And that's what's happening right now. You have the power to achieve anything you want. Don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals. And remember, stay focused, stay strong, and stay positive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.